Crews spent Friday morning checking the structural stability of a London theater after a roof partially collapsed during a Thursday night play. Dozens were injured, and now authorities are focusing on what caused the accident. Marley Hall has the latest. The area outside this iconic London theater was blocked off Friday morning, one day after part of the ceiling collapsed during a show. Overnight, inspectors worked to try to figure out what may have caused Thursday's accident. It would appear it was, there was no warning. There was just a sudden collapse of, and again, plaster and some beams from the, the roof of the auditorium, which was at some considerable height. Theater goers exited the auditorium covered in dust. Authorities say nearly 80 people were injured, some with head wounds, but everyone made it out of London's Apollo Theater alive. More than 700 people had gathered to watch a popular play. Witnesses say just before the chaos, an actor yelled, watch out. A uh, loud bang. I don't think it was an explosion. And the ceiling came down. A lot of dust, chandelier, wood, and all that sort of stuff. We just looked up and the whole ceiling it was like slow motion. It just kind of came down. Within minutes of the incident, first responders arrived and rushed people to the hospital. Police say it doesn't look like the collapse was an act of foul play or terrorism. Marley Hall for CBS News. Now, the Apollo Theater was built in 1901. It has 775 seats, and last night, with less than a week before Christmas, most of those seats were filled.